you day everyone and welcome to the coin couch my name is Andrea well it's official she is sold out at the Perth Mint let's find out what the big deal is about Freya just like the Norse gods the first of the Norse goddesses Freya has a cardboard box nice headshot there and this houses the main engraved wooden box I really like the detail of this box and I think it really adds to the product as a whole I think that the Perth Mint has done a great job here with the packaging Inside is a certificate of authenticity with some information on Freya and of course the coin details. Two ounce silver, antique finish with a maximum mintage of 2,000 pieces. You can see there the little Perth Mint cushion and of course the coin itself. And like the Norse gods here, the design of the first Norse goddess has so much depth. It's a pleasure to look at. Close up, there's a better look at the detail. Now, if that doesn't symbolize love, beauty, fertility, battle, and death, I don't know what does. Another feature that I really enjoy about the Perth Mint antique coins is the smooth rim. On the reverse, of course, is the queen because this coin has been pressed on Tuvalu and the year 2017 there. Well, it's a very nice coin with an extremely attractive mintage. And it's no surprise that with the success of the Norse gods, Freya would also be a popular issue. But I think we all just need to be honest and say the real reason she sold out. Uh, she's hot as. thumbs up if you also think Freya is a very attractive coin. My name is Andrea and I'll catch you next Monday on the coin couch. Bye!